What's up, guys? Here today, DJ, where they back to you another video today. We back to do a TV show review of X Men '97. How y'all guys doing today? It's been a long time since I did a video. Two weeks ago, actually, I did a video. So here today, I hope y'all missing me here today. I got two more videos on to do before the big event happened. Maybe two more videos. The one will be coming out today, the other one will come out today as well. But anyway, uh, but how y'all got doing today? Like, you know, I'm doing, I'm doing fine myself here today, but here today we will be reacting um, to the, um, not react, but we will be reviewing uh, X-Men 97 here today. Before y'all see X-Men 97 here today, I recommend to watch on Disney+. Plus. And stuff like that. Also, you I mean you gotta watch the admin and me and say, hey, you want the full detail of, you know, how the show was made. So, go watch X Men, the animated series. Um, they did watch X Men like the seven show. Done with that. But let's get started here today. The X Men 97 with you. Here today, I'm gonna be straight fucking other with you, my guy. This show is fire. Fire. This show is the best show Marvel have put out. On the Disney Plus show. I don't care what nobody say. I don't care what people say. Falcon when I told you. Loki, Wonder Vision, Moon Knight, Miss Marvel, Secret Vision. I don't care. This is the best Marvel project Marvel had ever put on Disney Plus. And this show is great. Like, if you are a huge fan of the X Men animated series, if you are a huge fan, you would love this show. This show understands. What the X Men character is, you know, you got Cyclops, the leader of the X Men. Let let me fucking under it. Cyclops in the movie was straight booty cheeks. So if you're Jason, Jay Martin, no disrespect here. I think he would be a perfect Cyclops, but you know he got the him counter treatment. Great casting, but wasted potential. Then you got the tired Shadow. I never thought he'd be a great. Uh oh. Oh, hold on, real quick. My bad. But I never thought uh Tyler Shannon, I think the one the guy who played uh, Cyclops for the all apocalypse. The park it's my apocalypse with Dark Phoenix. I never thought he would be a great got something anyway. He could have potential but I never thought he was great. Um and something in the more after who played Cyclops some in the summer. You know what? Cyclops they put they put just as the Cyclops name. Thorn. She was great. When we even though when we were a lot like in practice enough. You know, in like impractical, I like it though because throughout the mo throughout 20 years, Wolverine have been the main focus of the X Men franchise. They never got anybody chance except for Wolverine, like Fox Universe. Fox, they love that. They love they Wolverine. Like they every time they like Wolverine, 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 Wolverine. Like it just like it just you know it 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 happy to see Wolverine not. Be the main focus this time around. Well, of course, you see, you know, a lot of people say, Oh my god, they move away. They waste potential for wing. Come, come on, guys. Yeah, they got dead proof of wing that come out. So, yeah. But anyway, um, the villain, Mr. Sinister, he one of my favorite villains. It's great to see him back. Bastion, I don't know what too much about Bastion to be honest, but I do like his character. The Magneto was great in this show. You could understand his character, you could understand. That he tried to go with Charlie Xavier Vision, but in reality, the humans won't let him do that. The humans to go humans and humans and humans, humans to go to hate the mutant, no matter what the mutant do, right? No matter what the mutant do, good, something like that, the human always going to hate. But anyway, this show was great. Now, who, where do I give this show to? This show, you know, to be Every, all the episodes were not bad. It was not a single bad episode. At all. It was not a single bad episode. So here today, this show gives like a... But anyway, I give this show like a 10 out of 10. I really enjoyed this show. Definitely one of the best Marvel projects. But here today, my next video will be... What is my ideal niner of the X-Men in the MCU? So here today, guys, leave it down below. Let's hunt this show, this show, we're gonna shout it out.
do so.